Hello my friends, welcome to my YouTube channel, my name is Artem Voronov, I am lighting designer and Dalux trainer. In this video I'm going to show you how to make fast lighting calculation for your office with round luminars. For my calculation I'm going to use this uh, plot of luminars and here we have catalog and which you can see and select some luminar. I'm going to choose this 4000 Kelvin luminar with uh, 150 watt. Okay, here it is. And this I have ES file for this luminar. Let's click on it and download it. To build your office first, you should use this room planning tool. Let's click on it with our left button. And let's set here profile of our office. I'm gonna set here uh, office profile and I'm gonna set here fill in the copy and write in top right in read and data processing. Uh, you can set any profile that you want that you have for this uh, example I'm going to use uh, like 10 meters by 10 meters 10 meters length but 10 meters width and height uh, 3 meter so you can set any lengths and width that you want that you have on your real project and let's click here on OK and now just in a few clicks uh, Dioxiva built for me my 10 meter room uh, so this is my office let's go to the top view and let's select spaces tool let's click on our calculation surface and then let's click here in edit and here you have your norms and standards according to that standard that you set i have here the latest standard in dialogue c1 in the latest in latest version so then i'm gonna play, uh, uh, select template section here i'm going to set office uh, writing tab writing reading data processing and also you can set here some modifiers if you have for example this point uh, the visual task is critical to the workflow you can uh, click to this checkbox and then you can set on one level your uh, lux level for example you had 500 lux if uh, you click to this checkbox you have uh, 750 lux okay i'm not going to click it but if you want you can click it as well so then I'm going to, when I selected this uh, surface, I'm going to make a wall zone offset. So I'm going to click to 0 0.5 meter. Uh, what we can see, we see that our calculation surface has offset now because maybe you have some shelves here. Uh, we can set here even maybe one meter offset, but I prefer to set uh, 0 0.5 uh, meter by default. Okay, and now in 3D you can see uh, that Dialoxiva built it not only a room but also a calculation surface on the height according to the standard. So this height is uh, 0.8 meters. Now I'm going to the top view and then I'm going to uh, my download folder and I'm going to drag and drop my Illuminar file here and as soon as I uh, just drag and drop it i'm going to delete it so now my file uh, right into the dialog seal so it's already in dialog seal and i'm going to draw my rectangle arrangement using this uh, draw a rectangle arrangement tool let's click on it uh, so first you select your first point and then you select your second point and then drag it right to that uh, bottom and then you have this automatic arrangement let's click on uh, calculation okay and now you see that you have uh, some calculation here and maybe you like this lighting effect maybe not visually but let's go to the result overview and we see that we have enough flux level but we see uh, here red indicator why it's red it should be green <laughs> because we have quite enough flux level but we have one a very important parameter this is uniformity uh, for our office we have 0 0.6 a uniformity level but we have with our arrangement we have 0 0.5 so to make our lighting more uniform let's click on our arrangement and let's go to this parameter view and let's add one more row okay so uh, results will be discarded okay yes okay and now i have one more row 
let's click to the calculation button here and let's click here then on uh, working plane and in this working plane now we have a green checkbox so it means that this is enough flux level and it is also uh, quite nice uh, uniformity that we need for our office okay let's go to the 3d view because this is not all so like we have enough flux level for uh, our lighting calculation but uh, let's go and check it visually you have here some arcs on the walls. So sometimes it's bad for our uh, room perception. Maybe sometimes we need more smooth and more architectural light. So for this, you can select uh, your arrangement and make some luminaires be closer to each other like these. So now I have about three meter between each luminaire. So you can check it here. Okay, so about three meters here, and also you have about three meters here. And now go to the copy and arrange uh, centered in the area. So now my arrangement right into the center of this room. And let's click to the calculation button and let's go inside of our room. And now we have quite smooth illumination on our walls if you want it may be more uniform and smoother you can move these uh, luminous close to each other uh, maybe my uniformity is a little bit less but visually my effect is much uh, more better and even if i have some less numbers sometimes visually this room might be more interesting for your office if you want to go deeper into the lighting design and if you want to make some corporate course for your company so uh, right in the description of this video i'm going to put this uh, pdf file uh, with my corporate uh, dialux evo course uh, light design dialux evo from beginner to pro uh, i have four modules here and if you want to order these training for your company you can contact me my contacts will be right into the bottom of this pdf file if you have some questions or if you want to order this course feel free to ask any question thank you for watching. subscribe to my youtube channel write a comment down below click the thumb up uh, click the to the bell icon not to miss our new videos write a comment down below if you have any questions and see you in the next tutorials